Hey guys, welcome to Kansas City. My name is Josh, AKA Vintage Kid. Check me out on YouTube and Instagram. Right here I'm showcasing one of my buddies, Vintage Card Collections. He has over 60 mantles, bunch of errands, bunch of maze. This is not, this is only the tip of the iceberg of it. Has some T206. Um, let's see, the hardest part's highlighting which one I want to highlight, but the first one I want to highlight is the 61 Tops Mickey Mantle. These are hard to find centered, and the color, and usually they found, you find a lot of snowing on them. So this is the best conditioned mantle I've ever seen in my life. So, and, and you, for these kind of cards, if you breathe on them, they're wrinkled. So, they're amazing. And next we'll do 62 tops. 6.5, really high grade. And then, in the comment section, which one would you rather have? <laughs> the 5 or the 6.5? Because I, I personally rather have this, because this has no shipping. Um... And then the last one I'll kick off on is this Kitty Bransfield. You guys were wondering who the heck is Kitty Bransfield um, and why is he $800? Well, that's because Old Mill back. And if you were to look up pop reports, there's only, six, there's only this is the sixth one known to exist. Only five between PSA and SGC. The last one sold in 2022 for $990. Best car I've ever had. Um, well, anyway, I'll hand it to you, Dre. Thanks, Josh. We're here in Kansas City. I'm still on the hunt for that Negro League Baseball memorabilia. I've had no luck. Now, I should have probably started my search of all places at the Negro League Museum. Take a look. I spent a fun day at the Negro League Baseball Museum located here in Kansas City. A must stop for any baseball fan, the Negro League Museum spotlights baseball's integration pioneers. The museum is dedicated to preserving the rich history of the Negro League and its trailblazers. While visiting the museum, I had the privilege of checking out some cool baseball history. I couldn't leave the museum empty-handed. Here's what I picked up. An autograph card of Kansas City legend and Baseball Hall of Famer, Buck O'Neill. I also picked up autographs from some of the greats of the Negro League. Every autograph has a sticker of authenticity from the Hunt Auction House. Now, let's get back to the card show. So, right there, look at that. That's very cool. Hello, how are you guys doing? We are here at Kansas City Harrah's 
come on out to my shop, Eric Fink, EJ Sports Cards and Collectibles at 10388 S Road in Hoyt, Kansas, just 15 minutes north of Topeka. And from the top of my heart, thank you, and we'll see you again.